time is 4.15 and I think there's a bad idea for the raid. We're outside Give the Beauty friends. and the Beast college. Let's all smile bigger, open our hearts, and believe in our dreams. Alors, êtes-vous prêts? Woo. Tous ensemble, rêvons. Et le monde s'illumine. So now, are you ready for the ride? Yeah. It's time to dream. Walt Disney Studios to get to the magic Mickey and the magic show let's go to this one scan the first one uh, down So this is the place where they have Mickey and the Magic Show and you can reserve your seats by paying around 13 euros at the time of filming this video. It is currently 125. 26. 26, yeah. sorry, it changed. Um, and we are currently the only ones waiting here with a reserved seat. VIP seat. Let me show you. This is the main entrance and this is the queue. 
And look, this is blocked. This is for the main public. Right, so we are here for our 5 past 2 show. It is a lot earlier than 5 past 2 right now, but what we have discovered is there was a queue outside of people waiting to come in already, so we joined the queue. And then we went forward in the queue and then realised we were in the wrong queue because we've reserved um, tickets. So we have guaranteed seats. So the guy was like, no, you've got to go out and scan your ticket and come in the other way and then you get right to the front. So you, so, you treat it like a VIP basically? Yeah, so right now we're waiting okay. at the front of the doors. Yeah for the doors to open so we can go in and just claim our seats and this is the normal queue if you don't want to pay you have to queue up like everyone else but if you pay online reserve it you can go right in front and get treated hopefully like a vip dear guests we are pleased to welcome you to animagic theater we would like to remind you that drinking and eating are not allowed inside the theater we want you to enjoy the show fully so please do not stand up during the performance. If you need to leave during the show. Welcome to my workshop, Nikki. Comme tu le vois, ça mérite un bon coup de balai. As you can see, it needs a good clean. Oui, monsieur le magicien, mais j'ai hâte de faire de la magie. <laughs> but you can't practice your magic picky until this room is hopeless. Oh, oui, monsieur. D'accord. Cet atelier sera impeccable avant que je fasse de la magie. And one last thing. You need to be finished before the moon disappears from the sky. La lune? Wow! Tout brillera avant que la lune ne disparaisse. Je vous le promets! Good. And remember, a true magician always keeps his promises. Un vrai magicien tient toujours ses promesses. Good luck, Mickey. Take what you got and you 
minutes. And Zed is going. She wants to play Jasmine in Aladdin. Et coupé. C'est dans la boîte, les amis. Je n'ai jamais travaillé avec des acteurs aussi doués de toute ma carrière. Je vous verrai dans le film. Oh my goodness, fantastic. Nice everyone. Okay, big smiles, everybody. Stand by the roll. Camera. Action. Don't people call my people. Let's do lunch. Ciao. Hello, friends. I have a little stage direction for you. To make your magic carpet fly higher or lower, you in the front row. Welcome aboard. Please pull down your left body. For your own safety, remain seated with your hands, arms, feet and feet and legs inside the carpet. And please watch your children. Tout le monde sourit. Préparez-vous à filmer. Lumière, caméra. C'est tout. The time currently is 6.36 p.m. of uh, day three Disneyland vlogs. We're knackered, exhausted, but had a fantastic time. This guy's full of energy. This oh, it's here. Disneyland. You have to have lots of energy. Um, what are your thoughts about Disneyland? Uh, right, okay. Out of the two parks, Disneyland Paris and Walt Disney Studios, I'm going to go out on a limb and say Walt Disney Studios is my favourite. It's too. by far the better part of the two for me mm -hmm. in terms of the rides are all closer together and it has some exceptional rides. Does Groot agree with you? Hey Groot, do you agree with that view? I uh, am Groot. Listen. I am Groot. Oh, he said yeah, he agrees with that. Of course, this is up to open to different opinion, but I prefer Walt Disney Studios over the main park for many different reasons. It's much more manageable. The rides are close to each other. Oh, wherever you go, whichever you park you go, you're going to have lots of queues and rides and food places. Speaking of food places, it's very, very difficult to eat something decent without having to do a mission walk, without having to reserve something. What did you think of that? Like having a snack or a yeah, meal? Yeah, snacks mainly, I would say uh, food places you can probably find, but you need to try to avoid the lunchtime. So you need to either eat early in like late morning or late afternoon yeah. if you can last that long. Yeah. Um, we've been sticking to early morning which worked for us. Uh, late morning, sorry, for which worked for us. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the food places themselves are get very busy very quickly um, and it's hard to find if you have specific dietary requirements, so vegetarian only or you're looking for fish and chips for example. We only found for one place that does fish and chips. Yeah, basically there are many food places but um, they're all good luck finding a seat that's the main issue if you and haven't reserved something in regards to snacks we spent a long time looking to buy ice cream and yeah. um, the only place that we managed to find initially with a selection of ice creams rather than just the two or three basic ones um, said it was cash only and we didn't have euros on us we only had card but we couldn't we that's couldn't only buy one place cream. yeah Basically, that was the only place we found at the time. basically, Disneyland and Walt Disney Studio—they got lots of fun to offer, but 
you need to do a bit of planning otherwise you could get disappointed you need to make sure you're wearing suitable comfy shoes because there's gonna be lots of walking and just read up on some of the terms and condition like you can't bring selfie One sticks. One of the main things that I would like to add is there is not a lot of signage. No, so definitely. if you do not have ball. the app and the map of you don't ask people, you are not going to find your way around it easily, especially yeah. in the Disneyland park because yeah. it's bigger and there's more space between all the rides. Yeah. It's very easy to get lost mm. and oh, turn yeah. around, especially on your first day. But once you get used to it, then it's actually not that difficult. And if you use the app, highly recommend to use the app, you can get a map. They actually show where you are and tells you how to get to whatever place you want to get to. Uh, also toilets, that wasn't very easy to find. Walt Disney are much easier. The main Disney park, not easy to find. But in terms of the rides, the staff are very organized. The way they operate the rides, well done to them. Very, very organized. Queues, very long, even on the quietest season and food places price naturally is going to be very expensive and but the shows and the parades are well worth watching at least once yeah so if you haven't seen one i definitely recommend you watch it at least once it is entertaining um but having said that if you have seen it once on day one maybe no not really a need to look go again yeah. on day two because you're going to be almost identical yeah